Former Hollyoaks and Coronation Street star Stephanie Davis has revealed she's expecting a baby boy. In a chat with OK! Magazine, alongside her partner Joe McElroy, the 31-year-old expressed her joy about the forthcoming addition to their family. Stephanie is also mum to a 7-year-old son. The road to this point has been a roller coaster for Stephanie who sadly experienced a miscarriage in May 2022. Stephanie and Joe, 27, first met during a group therapy session in 2021. Currently 16 weeks pregnant and due in January, Stephanie admitted that it's been a tough journey, reports The Mirror. She said, after my previous miscarriage, I thought, God's going to be good to us, it'll be plain sailing. But that's not how life works, confesses Steph, with a smile. It's been a roller coaster. Despite undergoing fertility tests and trying for a baby for two years, Stephanie fell pregnant naturally. I did the pregnancy test at my mother-in-law's. I could not believe it. I've done a million tests over the past two years and videoed them the one time I didn't, it was positive. However, she faced another challenge when blood tests showed her HCG, pregnancy hormone, levels were dangerously low and not doubling as they should be. The doctor said he believed I was having another miscarriage or an ectopic pregnancy. But I wasn't having it, I had this strong gut feeling that it was all going to be okay. Joe confessed that medics even requested him to have a word with her as she was in denial about the situation. A few days later, Steph was out with Cobbine for a haircut when she received a call. It was one of the lovely nurses from the Buchanan Suite in Whiston Hospital. She said, Steph, this is a miracle. Your HCG levels haven't doubled they've tripled. The couple could finally breathe a sigh of relief. However, Steph later discovered she had a hematoma, a collection of blood outside the blood vessels, which she also experienced during her miscarriage two years ago. I was hysterical, on total bed rest, bleeding, she discloses. Remarkably, the day before their recent trip to Mallorca, they were informed that the hematoma had vanished and the baby was fine. But Steph fell ill while on holiday, and upon returning home, she found out she had contracted C. diff, a bacteria that causes diarrhea and colitis. Don't ever Google that if you're pregnant, cautions Steph. I was terrified. I'm still on medication to treat it, but I'm slowly recovering. We need a holiday after the holiday, jests Joe, who admits he doesn't know how Steph got through it all. But on a brighter note, the couple's faces light up when we ask about the moment they discovered the gender of their baby. Joe and I just wanted it to be the two of us when we found out, began Steph. It was so emotional. When the nurse said it was a boy, and the lights in the room went blue. It's a moment well cherished for the rest of our lives. Joe never cries, so when he started that set me off. We were just sobbing on each other. Then the nurse in the room started crying, too. However, they have already decided on a name. We've always had a name for a boy and a girl, she reveals. Incredibly, the day before a recent holiday to Mallorca, they were told the hematoma had disappeared and the baby was fine only for Steph to fall ill while abroad, before discovering upon her return that she had picked up C. diff, a bacteria that causes diarrhea and colitis. We might change our minds once he arrives, though. When Cobbin arrived I realized he was not at George. So we'll see. Steph is currently wearing a promise ring that Joe has pledged to replace with an engagement ring. So, could wedding bells be ringing soon?
it's 100% going to happen, but I think I'll have this baby first, Joe discloses. As they prepare for what they hope will be a very boring and uneventful remainder of this pregnancy, Steph confesses that after the baby arrives, she'd be overjoyed to return to Coronation Street, where she played Courtney Vance. I absolutely loved it. Jimmy, Harkishan, who plays Dev, called me the other day, I love Jimmy. I'd love to go back. It's like the Premier League of telly. I've got them all on Insta, we chat a lot. So we shall see. The album's being finished, it's amazing. It was just a vibe, and I used Aretha Franklin's mic. It was a dream. But right now, Joe and I are focusing on another dream welcoming our baby boy to the world. To see all the exclusive pictures and watch video footage visit OK.co UK or pick up a copy of OK Magazine.